I, I don't understand. I, I give you one small task and you find a way to mess it up. Like seriously, how hard is it to pay one bill online? It's, it's not, it's not hard. I'm sorry I'm not perfect all the time, okay? But it was one bill and it was just one time. I Leave it to you to make it a bigger deal than it really is. Oh my gosh, one bill, one time? Um, I'm pretty sure getting our electricity shut off is a memorable fail. Okay, yeah, I sent it to the wrong account. I made a mistake, okay? But I apologize. You forgave me and I thought we'd move forward, but here you are bringing it up again? I'm just trying to be accurate. Whatever. I, I don't really want to talk about it anymore. Can you just pay the bill when we get home, please? Because you did say you were going to pay it, so. Fine. Great. It's Friday. You want to do anything tonight? Yeah, actually, I was thinking maybe we cook something together, then we start binging season three. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure, like, fine? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Cool. <laughs> We're out of coffee again? Seriously, Corey, I asked you to get more on the way home. Crap. Oh, I'm sorry, babe. I I forgot that I'll get some more at the store. You just, you just literally do this every time. Like, I can't, I can't even depend on you for coffee. It's just, it's ridiculous. I, but, what just happened? Seriously, Corey? Again? With the toothpaste cap. I've told you a thousand times to put it back on because it dries out and it attracts ants. so careless lately. I'm not kidding. He has forgotten like everything. I, I just, it's making me feel really disconnected from him. If I'm honest, we, girl, we haven't been on a date in like a month. Oh, uh, mm -mm. so no, nope, can't have that. I mean, have you, have you actually asked him to go out? You know, you gotta like <laughs> tell, tell your man what you need. I mean, no, but <laughs> he knows I like to go out. So it seems yeah, obvious. He doesn't. Well, maybe he doesn't know what you're feeling, you know? If you don't, if you're not open with him and you kind of communicate what you're feeling, he can't read your mind, you know? So, I mean, you know communication is the most important part of any relationship. Look at these roots, girl. I mean, you're right. I should probably talk to him. Okay. Be wise. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll do it tonight. I'll talk to him tonight. Hey. Hey. I wanted to talk to you. Yeah, I wanted to talk to you too. Oh, okay. You first. Lately, I've just felt like we're on different pages. <laughs> I hate upsetting you and disappointing you and it lately it just feels like I can't do anything right. So I just wanted to, you know, I wanted to check in and see what's going on with you and if you're noticing the same thing. I'm so sorry. I've just been feeling really disconnected from you and I, I don't know why. I just, I, you know, I've been wondering why we, why we don't go out anymore and we haven't been on a date in forever and I just feel like we stay home all the time. I just started creating these expectations, you know, what I thought we should be, and focusing on the little things instead of, you know, focusing on you, and I, and I realized that's so unfair. 
I should have just told you what I needed instead of assuming you could read my mind. I'm sorry. I love you and I promise from now on, I'm going to communicate with you about what I need from you and from our relationship. Thank you for telling me that. You know, I just assume that you love that show so much and that's why we've been staying in, but that's, it's not an excuse. I promise to ask you what you need. I promise to put more effort into us as well. I love you. I love you too. Hey, thanks so much for watching this video. If you love this video about why communication is so important in every relationship, please do us a favor and help us change the world by hitting that share button down below so that more people can see more messages like this.